let's talk about mental health. Where is your mental health? Where is your status? How are you doing? For me, I'm doing okay. These days have been better. I have been practicing peace. I have been practicing self-strength. I have been practicing my self-worth. I have been learning to love on me extremely more than I've ever had in my whole life. I have learned that um, I will no longer let people do things to me that I am not doing to them. Um, I have learned that self-love can be the best love that one has ever had. And knowing whom I am and whom I am is the best gift that God could have gave me at this time, life after 50. I thank God that I can look in the mirror and like myself and smile at myself. I thank God that when I look back over my life and see where he's brought me from, it's been a mighty long journey and I won't let him down ever. Um, I, I realize that the promises of God is real. And if you just keep hold to your promises to yourself and show up for yourself and God will meet you there. I realized so many things, you know, life after 50, life after loss, you know, life after COVID-19, the world, you know, I, I look at our world even different. I look at our government even different. And it just made me, you know, really just turn to God and say, Lord, I thank you. I thank you for being the governor, the author and the finisher of my life. I thank you, God, for all the amazing things that you have been to me my whole entire life. Without you, God, I am nothing. That's where my mental health is today. I thank God because he teaches me daily the principles, the tools that I need to win and to succeed in life, to overlook things that are right there in front of me trying to knock me down. He allows me to walk past them. He lets me see the snake and he lets the snake see me and he still saves me. You understand what I'm saying? I thank God because the things that I don't know that he do for me. How about that? I am just a very thankful person right now. Thankful to the good Lord because he looks upon my faults and better yet, he sees my needs. Things that man have no idea of what to do for me. I thank God because I've decided one day that I would never fall back into my bad habits. The things that used to give me pain, the things that used to give me turmoil, the things that hurt me, the things that meant me no good. The, the, the people who spent my money and never in return said when they got their money, here, here's a little something. He keeps me away from people like that. People who don't think like you think and love like you think and appreciate like you appreciate. He keeps me from those people. I thank God because he gives me new friends. He gives me new family members. He shows me that you are loved all around the table. It was you that had to start loving yourself. It was you who had to see yourself. You was always there. It's people that I will put in, in front of you to love you. Like you love yourself. But God said, I'm, wait, I'm waiting on you, daughter. If you make one step, I'll make two. So here's to my sisters and brothers. Make a step towards yourself. Show up for you. And God will show up too. God bless you.